All right, folks, this is Cat Ketter back from match three here on Hot Takes with some Goryeo's Vengeance action. It's all brought to you by Card Hoarder and... Huh. I think we're supposed to mulligan these type of hands, and the reasoning... Uh... Yeah, we're going to mulligan this. This just seems a little inconsistent. I don't like giving up the card on the draw if our opponent throws the thought sees at us, but I don't feel like this has a high enough chance to pay off on the one. So, And not much better, but I don't want to go lower. There we go. Hey, look, it's like the same hand. Okay, so that's actually good for us. Um, our opponent might just think we're a Grixis deck. We're going red-black here. I actually think I want to get rid of both these brutalities, but that might be incorrect, so we're going to split. Get rid of a creeping tar pit here. I think we'll hit one off these other sources. Tech is surprisingly mana hungry. Like, getting to five is definitely something you've got to work towards. Okay. I'm gonna hit it with the Serum Visions. So we've got that. Bottom top is actually good here. It gives us the third land. Yeah, I'm going to take the damage here to try to fire off a sleight of hand. I'm not, you know, very happy about giving that up, but let's see. Let's get blue red here. Guess we just take another sleight of hand. Like, our opponent's got us what looks like to be a two turn clock here, which is, you know, a little frustrating, but I think that'll be okay. Pretty sure our opponent takes the Emrakul here. This is our third Tarmogoyf deck in this queue. Pretty funny. So this is definitely one of those matchups where the mulligan, like exactly what happened. Giving up that spot's probably not a good thing to do. I'm pretty sure our opponent takes the Emrakul here. It also shuffles away our Faithless Looting flashback. Really? Huh. Well, 
If our opponent wants to give us a couple turns to fire off some stuff, we can make it work. Jeez. All right, we're going to I think we live through this still. Yeah, so we're still alive. We're just going to go to 1. This our opponent has the bolt. It's actually kind of funny. We're gauged exactly on that. If we hit it, we win the game. Doesn't change anything. All right, so we got three draws to hit a Gorio's Vengeance. <laughs> First one. Uh, red, blue. Draw, discard. Two. Trigger. Nail it. So unless our opponent has the... Uh, bolt. I think we're going to steal one. Looks like they do not. People love selecting their creatures for Annihilator. I'm surprised there's not more concessions. Defeated our opponent, so let's stick with what we've been going for. One charm, and then all of our creature removal. I actually want to... No. I don't want to cut Spirit Guide. I still feel like that that card's pretty important in these matchups. So we'll just run this. Cut Snapping a Goyf is like probably the dream to buy a couple extra turns. We really just want White Ley Line in the opener every time, which is what seems to be the general. Yeah, we'll keep this. Three lands. It's very hard to get rid of this. This one, this one. Actually, I don't think I want two. So the most common answer out of them will be Pulse. So we'll actually hold the second one. I can discard it at a later time. Uh, one's actually sufficient. Now from here, we're really just building up towards... getting to 20 or figuring out a way to get him with this land tapped pass it on back I was oh so that's actually a really nice one uh, both the goif our opponent wants to go land goif we can start with this Oh, couldn't do it. Uh oh. Wait. Oh no. <laughs> I'm still gonna get through the breach. <laughs> I thought we were dead. Oh man, that's great. So sometimes you just beat up on your uh, on your opponent. And if I draw a Simeon Spirit Guide next turn, our opponent is defeated. Sure. Four damage. Got it. Eight. 
any land next turn, we're in good shape. Interesting on the Blood Moon. We definitely have, you know, pretty easy ways to get around that. Fetch up a swamp and you're just, you know, island swamp and you're set. Get mana source here. That'll do it. And get him. we played well we would have won all three of those matches against uh, the Jun deck okay okay this was Kent Cutter with hot takes bringing you three hot rounds of modern Jund action I mean Gorio's vengeance action hopefully we'll come back next round for something different thanks for checking in folks see you for round four